Welcome to another InfraScale training video. In today's session, we're going to go through how to set up a basic backup on a machine. First step is to download the software. InfraScale.com, resources and downloads. You can download the appropriate version here. If you go to the dashboard and log into the web portal, you can also scroll to the bottom and download the software here. And the download link is also included in the sign-up email that you get when you sign up for a backup account. Once installed on your machine, you use your username and password to log into the backup software. Once logged in, we select the wrench to manage our backup settings. So we have options to scan, and we can scan for all items and show us basically what we're looking at. Okay, so this is showing that as far as images, this is the biggest part of my backup. Music is the second biggest, and I don't need that. Uh, video is large, but I do these training videos, and I want that protected. So we'll keep this backup set in place. You can go to Advanced Options, and you could include or exclude certain files or folders uh, by size, type, or location. So let's opt to not scan, and we'll go to Next. And we'll just use the tree view to pick something to back up. So we'll select this entire folder, and that'll calculate. OK, it's less than 2 gigs, so very small backup. And now it's for scheduling time. So if you have a network domain password, you'd want to put this in here so that uh, if you're going to run the backup overnight when you leave the office and the computer's idle, it'll still run. Frequency depends on what type of machine we're really talking about and the amount of risk we want to incur as far as how much work could you potentially lose. Since this is a work machine and I'm an individual user, my backups are going to run quite quickly on, after the initial backup's completed. So I could say that you know I want a backup to run every two hours because that'll mean that I, at the most, lose two hours worth of work if something were to happen to all my files. If it's a bigger machine, maybe you can't run it that often because of uh, production resources. So if it's a file server, you get a daily, and you could do a start and end time. So you start it. Uh, generally when the business starts to slow down and you end it when the business starts to pick up. So, you know, let's say between 6 p.m. and 6 a.m., some sort. But we're not doing that type, so I'm just going to pick hourly, do it every two hours. Uh, because it's every two hours, I'm going to opt not to receive an email report, although I could. And then select Finish. So it's going to back up at the end of the wizard, and then it's going to run every two hours starting from now. I hit Finish. And I'll get a notification that the backup is about to run. There it is. And now here I have the backup agent actually running. And that is how to set up a basic backup set with the InfraScale Online Backup and Recovery Manager. For more information, visit our website. Check out our help resources, our knowledge base. Or you can give us a call at one of these numbers or chat with our reps working 24-7. Thanks and have a good one.